Right, so we've stumbled across some kind of weird ape factory and it appears to have a jump puzzle in it. So this is like a sign that there's going to be some tech. So we're going to have a go. Don't expect wonders because you, you definitely won't see them. Although we do complete it, it's a rather embarrassing attempt. But nevertheless, let's get underway. And there's my first death right there. Um, now, the key is obviously to not touch the stupid lightning and to use these weird little platforms to be able to make your way through the puzzle to the tech. That was kind of cheating. So this bit was a bit harder. Um, as you can see, I'm experimenting with the first tech I've already got, which was Dash. It might be cheating, but um, I still think it's a valuable way of, of getting through. Uh, I'm going to have to heal up here because simply that lightning is rather deadly. You can cheese your way through these places, but recommended and more fun to have a go at doing it properly. An amazing little addition to the game. I haven't come across any others yet, so please let us know if there's... Uh, any others you'd like to share with us because uh, they're really cool. Um, I've come across plenty of mini dungeon things but nothing like this which necessitates actually having to use some skill which clearly I, I don't appear to possess. Um, this seems to be the end of it but uh, definitely the hardest bit so I need to eye my way down. Uh, these two platforms on each, either side look quite important although for the first attempt uh, as you will see, I just just decide to drop, and for some reason, I dash. Kind of retarded, as you can see, and there's my death. Um, but back again, and I'm going to, yes, try using the platforms like such. And again, I'm still pretty stupid, but I tried. I think I need to heal up here, because this next jump is crucial to getting through. Uh, it's a shame there's no actual apes here, because that could be really interesting if you're getting attacked as well, make it very difficult. But I somehow managed to make this bit, uh, and then the, the final couple of hops are important as well. Uh, I do think I fall off here or something. Yeah, I'm literally so stupid. But still, uh, that's pretty much it. As you can see, I just about make it. And then I sort of, again, I'm using this dash, which some people might not necessarily have, so you'd have to jump to that first, uh, that top platform there. And at the bottom there's a chest with a tech in it rather disappointingly it is energy dash which I have already got so that was all for nothing really but I suppose if you you know it's meant to be done without energy dash and that is your reward so I got given another tech which I'll probably give to James because that's kind so if you enjoyed this video or you found it helpful in any way or you just like watching me fail a couple of times and you want to see more because we're always stumbling across random things like this in Starbound, the amazing game that it is, then please like the video, share it, subscribe to the channel and we'll be sure to bring you more stuff. If you're not already aware, we are doing a Let's Play series at the moment which is starting to heat up and I've also put up a couple of guides on the first boss uh, including one in which Darren and I take him on naked with nothing but a crappy bow and a dagger which is relatively amusing although unfortunately fairly easy so if you did enjoy this footage please let us know and we look forward to catch you again next time